Today is my third attempt at trying to record a video with the Aldrich family. The first attempt, which got deleted, uh, I aged up baby Elsie and Sawyer. And that I wanted to give her a little, like, you know, makeover for fall. Same with Grace. I wanted them to be warm because it's going to be winter soon. I noticed with the new stuff pack, an outfit would work so good for Eloise. So I decided I'm going to um, change one of her outfits into that outfit. The Roaring Twenties, you get away with wearing shorter dresses and your hair shorter. and But this is like, this is like country. Like you're working on a farm and... So things are a lot more simplistic than they are, you know, like in the big city. So that is why I'm trying to keep it as simple, like Little House of the Prairie kind of vibe as I can. Um, okay, let me try to find that stuff pack. And then hopefully we can find that dress. Home Chef Hustle. And it is this one. Not this outfit, though. Um, okay, so we have that as a formal, how about we do this one? Because I don't really love that dress anyways. Not very much. Get rid of the athletic. And, ah, oh, it's so nice to have, like, a different kind of dress. Now I just don't know what color swatch to go with. See, that would be cool. You can't go with something really bright like that. It has to be like this, like natural. I don't want to go white though. I think that this, this is like a good combination because their beds are kind of all this color. And I feel like the fabric, you know, makes sense that she would have this like color of fabric and stuff to make this dress. Um, Shoes though, we need like, you know, work shoes, not, um, I need to get rid of athletic shoes. Get her, like, a pair of these. These are more, like, sun shoes. Makes some more sense than the others. Okay, I think I'm going to stick with flats, but the hair, the hair has got to go. I just, I don't like it on her that much. There are better updos than this. Actually, I think I'm going to keep with the the medium length. Maybe it was long. Yeah, it was definitely long. Yeah, that makes more sense. This is like her. Okay, so like I said before, Elsie was born. That was the last one that you guys were able to see. And I aged her up. By the way, the hat and back hair in delivery was ridiculous because I had no idea that Tom had that kind of back hair. And then Eloise um, put her, like, swimsuit on, and that's why I got rid of the hat because that was just insane. Um, but I, I did, like, make everything a little bit bigger, if you could tell. That way, you know, we could fit... Three kids in one room. Grace here, Sawyer here, and Elsie there. Elsie. Oh, she's having gas trouble. Put her in the crib. So it's literally about to become winter. And this is what I've been, like, prepping this family for. Like, we're doing the simplistic life. And we're doing the canning and... The fishing and like saving up our own food and like you know all of that stuff I and I want to make it like to where we can really thrive during winter like that is my goal for this and making it where we have enough food um okay the heater okay we have the fireplace here we have the wood-burning stove in a bedroom. Now, I don't know if that's going to, like, suffice as, like, heat. Like, are they going to stay warm with this? I have no idea. 
I will tell you that hidden behind this fridge, licorice would move out of the way, is a thermostat. I've never used it. Not yet, but when I started it when they were in spring. I have no idea if we're going to need it or not, but I wanted to have it there just in case they were freezing and like, you know, some stuff was going down. Like, I had to put a mixer in. I don't know if you could store I'm sure you can. These in the fridge, but I'll show you the fridge. Um, it is very well stocked. Um, I will tell you that once fall is over that I'm going to be um, selling the chickens and the cow for meat or money and then we're literally going to be just surviving. So it's going to be interesting. I'm not going to buy any extra food. They have to survive the entire winter which in mine is 28 days so <laughs> i i don't know how that's gonna go currently we have a lot of food but we still have a lot of work to do i just realized we have no milk so we need to really work on that today getting a lot of milk a lot of eggs a lot of fish and i honestly i need to put an order in for we need to make enough money that we can last on. Luckily, he's got his woodworking station. She's got a floral arrangement station. And we've got this uh, wax candle station back here. I'm going to trade for probably ingredients and produce. Because we can make money off of the fish that we have and that is the goal so i'm gonna have tom just go fishing like the whole day he needs to get up go fishing with sawyer that'll be good he can raise his skill level tom's already at 10 he's maxed out um if you didn't know who these graves were back here that's tom's mom and dad the whole storyline in the beginning was that uh, Tom, his dad, died and left him this farm. They were living in Winneburg. Uh, he just got a really good job, and um, but his dad fell sick, and he came home, and then he obviously gave him the farm so that they had to take it over and they decided to take it over and and here they are now and i'm pretty excited wait what is oh he has to pee that's fine because i need you to get that done today those two that is a good chore for them to be doing grace will leave eloise on baby elsie duty and then Grace can come over here and work on cleaning the chicken coop and collecting the eggs and feeding them. Same stuff with the milk and the cow and also the goat. So, or the baby sheep. I, I can't ever remember if I have a baby goat or a sheep, but it is a baby sheep. All right. She is on it. Sawyer has caught a guppy. Well, that's excellent. Okay, everything's going good. Grace is in an awesome mood because so she did it, but things are going well. Also, we still have to sell off our crop, which I have no idea if it needs work. Honestly, it looks pretty good. Oh, we need spray for bugs. Okay, these are pretty good. We need to milk her. I'm going to try to milk her twice. See how that goes. Please always feed your daughter. Okay, I'm going to try to milk her again. See what happens. See, I'll probably end up trading her for um, ingredients. Or maybe we'll just do the simoleons. I feel bad, but it's like part of life, so we have to. Oh, no. Okay. 
She's good. Eloise, not so much. What is wrong with you? Where is all the babies in the crib? I need to have her can. But I'm going to let her take a shower first. Even a bubble bath. I don't know what is dirty. There's usually like play tidying up somewhere on a shelf. Oh, that's what it is. Okay, I'm going to check on Tom. See what he's caught. A lot of small fish. And he's at level 10. You know what? We're going to sell them though. Oh, that's a hundred dollars. Wait, what? Mounted beta. I'm just gonna let him keep fishing. Oh, okay. He didn't do half bad. I wonder what skill he is at. Oh, he's he's at a level two almost. At level three, that's incredible. I would like to get him to a level ten as well. Um, he would be so advanced for his age. Okay, so it is clear that Eloise, once she's done with her bath, needs to um, make dinner. Even though she's very tired. Oh, it's, it's maybe I should have looked at the time. It's literally 12.48 p.m. Oh, oh, he caught her tilapia worth $51. She's cleaning up. You know what, I'm going to have her take a little nap. And then I'll have her make dinner. He can always eat something. Have him take a nap too. Maybe we'll hold that off a little. Okay, so we got the tilapia, which we're going to sell. Um, we're going to keep the tuna. That'll be really good to keep. He got a minnow. Eight bucks. It's $8 we did not have. What is Grace up to? Oh, Grace is doing good. Okay. Let's have her try again. And milk. Get as much as we can. While we can. Because we only have... Oh, wow. Okay. This is the last week of fall. So winter is very soon. The next video that I post, it will be winter or it will literally about to be winter um it's like getting cold and they're gonna try and not use like the actual heat i really want to make it work even if i have to add in another wood burner i don't know where but like maybe in their room i don't know if I had to, I could get rid of the teddy bear and put one, like, right in the corner. I mean, because it will still work because of Sims. And then I could always put the teddy bear, like, in here. Like, right here or something. That That's a good plan. Did she get the extra milk? She did. Okay, good. Good deal. I'm going to try and play this even when I'm not recording. And focus on like really getting things set up because I want to make it like it sounds terrible, but I want to make it like difficult but doable at the same time. Okay, no eggs to collect, but there is. Wait, I need to have her put that in her inventory. I'm trying to hold off until the last minute to um get these out. I guess she, she could maybe. Ray, No, she can't. Alright, I think Tom's done for the day. I'm gonna have him spray for bugs. That way everything's taken care of. Oh, we have a bunch of evolved plants. Okay, is that one? No, it's hard to tell. Okay, this one, which is a raspberry. Evolve. Evolve. And they're such good quality now. Right, I think that is it. Yeah, we have a lot of stuff. So, that's really good. We'll keep everything that we see here. Uh, where did that sheep go? There it is, hopping around. <laughs> Caught it in midair. I want to shear. 
wool. I had to get rid of the clothesline and the wash tub. It was driving me insane. So I'll bring it back in the spring. For now, they're just going to be as they are. Um, I need to feed. You know, Licorice has her own home, but she likes to stay in the house. Like, even after I locked the door, she was, like, hanging out in the house, so I don't know. Okay, well, I think I'm going to end the video here. A uh, pretty successful day. A lot of work on all ends of the family. Uh, like I said, I'm just going to keep working on it, trying to raise as much money as I can. And I think that is it. Saw that too. We got like 1500 I need like at least 3000 Tom really loves um, the cross stitch. Um, while Eloise was pregnant, Tom was like a cross stitch king. So, see, look, $92. So, we'll have him, like, you know, cross-stitch something. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.